welcome to the fourth and final day of my vlogs. Um, I think this day is going to be probably more of like a highlight reel than an actual vlog just because it's our last day I want to enjoy it. But we're just strolling towards Magic Kingdom for Magic Hours. Morning. <laughs> morning. Um, and then probably just kind of see where the morning takes us within. I keep calling it, I call it Magic Kingdom. I know, I used to do the same. I always call them Magic, Magic Kingdom. It's not it's just Disneyland Park. Yeah. Well, yeah, so we're going to head into Disneyland Park to begin with. Have a little wander around, enjoy Magic Hours. And then spend the rest of the morning there and then maybe around like lunchtime head over to the other park just so that we can have a few hours in studios as well today and just kind of enjoy like the best of both parks while we still have the time to do so but oh my god it's busy this morning it really is <laughs> everyone just ran for the shuttle I was like ah! <laughs> I know and it's a case of like every single day we've watched it get a little bit busier yeah. Yeah. so it's going to be busy because it's a Saturday. Saturday yeah and we had that AP party yesterday so everyone's probably still here yeah so I definitely say like just be aware if you're coming over a weekend it might be nice to kind of come on like oh, the first we could have gone down there probably yeah, well. it's fine it doesn't look too busy here <laughs> Um, area of the castle, which I'd actually never done. It's kind of been shut, or we haven't had time because I was never here long enough. So it's really nice to actually see it. It's quite small, but it's really cool. We'll show up with them one. Thank you. Um, but yeah, so we're going to go on Space Mountain, which is such a good ride. So I'm very excited. of walking around Fantasyland in the extra magic hours when you're not rushing to Peter Pan's flight. You can just see so much more. Like, I don't know, I just find parks can be lovely, but when they're super busy, they just seem twice as draining. Like, I feel like the day goes longer if you're having to weave around people and you can't just like have a little wander around anywhere. If you're wondering where I am, by the way, this is the wall that's covering, it's a small world. It's under renovation at the moment. Well, they're sorting some stuff out, so. Teacups, yeah, let's go do the teacups.
Look at that for a wolf. Bonjour et bienvenue au pays des contes de fées. Pour votre sécurité et votre confort, veuillez rester assis pendant la durée du voyage. parents <laughs> taking their children on a ride on Casey Jr. <laughs> the crowds quite a lot which is quite nice I think basically when it's really busy go do the ride that you don't normally do like I think if you rush to the likes of Big Thunder and everything first then when you come out of Big Thunder everything else is busy but we've been quite fortunate that we have missed the queues in the majority of cases um, oh, 
I'm getting the spray from the waterfall. Oh, great. Again, I'm quite hungry. You'll kind of get a theme in these vlogs is we're always hungry. Um, but I mean, when in Disney, why not? So I think because it's still before 11, we can't really go anywhere for food. So we're going to wander over, maybe do Indiana or Big Thunder Mountain, maybe. Even though I just said we'll avoid the queues. I feel like we can wait in a couple and then hopefully get something to eat. So we've just sat down for some brunch. I'd say it is now, it's just gone 11. Um, if you want to grab anything savory, you kind of have to wait till at least 11. But we decided to try the Mickey pretzel sandwich. Um, it comes with two options. There's one with like tomatoes and salad and there's one with ham and cheese, which is the one that we went for because I, mean, I just don't like tomatoes. But look how big it is. I'll put it up, keep it up against your head. It is. Um, a key head sandwich but it looks super tasty so I think we're gonna try it now what do you think so good so I quickly filmed a little bit of my phone but basically we're stuck on Big Thunder and they evacuated so that's me I've done a space mountain with the lights on. I thought so we would have been with the lights on, but turns out Merci de we're off. Aww. Oh, Ladies and gentlemen, no. your attention please. We regret that our adventure cannot continue at this time. Please follow instructions from our cast members to leave the attraction. Thank you. Meine Damen und Herren, ich bitte um Ihre Aufmerksamkeit. It sucks, but I've had it before where they've given you a fast pass. Is it bad? Just because obviously we did wait. Please follow the instructions of the personnel. Jammer genoeg kan ons avontuur voorlopig niet voortgezet worden. Gelieve de instructies van onze medewerkers te volgen om deze attractie te verlaten. Dank u voor uw begrip. Still here. Look, still here. Still waiting. Still really not sure what's going on. They're saying they're having to wait for colleagues, but. Colleagues keep coming and going and we don't know what's going on. Yeah, we've seen a lot of colleagues and no one's lifted the bars. We are stuck here. I think we're going to have to call EasyJet and be like, we're not going to have to catch our flight because oh, we're too busy working in the mines. In the mines. In the mines. In the mines. Where a million diamonds shine. It's going to punch someone. Someone, I'm ready. Hi there. 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 <laughs> I can just see you in the back. The hat's back on, so it's official. We ain't riding Big Thunder this time. Grogu's back on the shoulder, where he belongs. He escaped! They let us off! Um, I still, we still don't really know what happened, but basically, after we turned the first corner, the ride just came to our... We had like, the usual jolt it has before it goes uphill. And then it just stopped. stopped. <laughs> and I turned to the open and I was like, wait a second. And then the lights turned on and I was like, oh my God, are we going to ride it in the light? Because obviously I'd done Space Mountain in the light and I was like, it's so fun. But we didn't ever really get around to actually riding it. It just kind of no. sat there. People kept coming and going. We didn't know what was yeah, happening. Yeah, all the, like, the cast members were just like wandering around like with purpose. And we were like, what is going on? But fortunately enough, we were let off relatively quickly. They did it super professionally, like props to the cast members to be honest because they got us out quickly, efficiently and safely. They did, they did. And they've given us a fast pass to go back. So once we finish the parade, we can head back and ride it again without having to wait. Even though, to be fair, we didn't have to wait the first time because of my pass. It still is really kind of them to do. So I'm getting, I'm marching towards the parade. So we're just waiting for the parade now. We arrived probably just over an hour early yeah. and there were already queuing. queues. Yeah, so we've managed to get front row, but like we didn't like manage it very well, did we? Um, like we didn't get where we wanted to exactly, but we're like next to where no, we're close enough. Exactly, we're still gonna have an amazing view. 
but definitely if you're planning on watching the parade you and you're here. coming here on the weekend, even the Friday, just get here as early as you feel comfortable with waiting if you want to have that nice view. And like for me, because parades are such a big thing, I'd rather get here early. I did view. love the parades. I mean, we haven't done all of them. I think this is probably like our fifth. Something like that, Fifth yeah. parade, but obviously at six, if you include the one that we just saw as we were walking in at Casey's yeah. on our first day. But yeah, definitely wait because although it's frustrating and we've had to like move out of the way a few times with people, once it gets about half an hour until the parade, the attendants do come and they do like Stop manage people. it a lot better. Um, otherwise you have people pushing in and barging and stuff, but it's not the nicest way for a parade where we are, but it's where we want to be because we've done like, a few different spots, haven't yeah. we? So we've definitely experienced like a bunch and I think after this one we can decide which is probably the best one. So we just finished watching the parade. Honestly, I cannot get on with that parade. It was so good. We got air kisses from Daisy. We got a full on shock from Donald again. Like, what can we say? I'm just, I'm a magnet for the Disney ducks. Um, and we got an air kiss from Miguel, which was just so cute. Like, honestly, proper topped off the trip. Like, I could go home happy now. But we're going to be even happier because we're going to go use our fast pass that we got for Big Thunder from being evacuated, which I'm still not over either. Like today's just being a wild day. Um, but we're going to go over, get that fast pass done, and then head over to studios for our last like hour or so we have in the parks just to enjoy it. And I really want to go to Toy Story Land in my bucket. Yeah. You've come to the right place. Lots of room to play. Oh, if you see Rex, heavy though, tell him I'm gonna lie. Yeah. Good for you with working out a little bit on those glutes, but. back to the hotel to get luggage and grab the shuttle to the airport. We've given ourselves quite a bit of time. Our flight's not till nine. It's currently half three-ish, but our shuttle's at 10 to five. Um, and they recommend getting the shuttle. It gets you to the airport three and a half hours before, but I think our shuttle, by the time we get there, will probably be like six-ish, but I feel like that'll be a good enough amount of time. Especially because I feel like they always tell you to get there early than you need to. 
So as long as we can get on the shuttle, fine. We can We've given ourselves plenty of time, so yeah, exactly. At least we can chill out and stuff before our flight. Yeah, well. definitely. And we still not had any lunch, so we're probably gonna head back and get something to eat, or at least a snack or something, just yeah. basically to see us through. Yeah. But we've had such a busy few days. I think you now we're like, right, enough's enough. Yeah, we've exactly. What we've to do. Yeah, there's no point pushing ourselves to get something else done that we don't really need to do. And we don't want to rush like we did, because that's what we did before. We did the drawing and then all of a sudden we're like, crap, we've got to go. We've got to run, yeah, exactly. So we're back at Santa Fe at the hotel Starbucks. I've just got myself another caramel macchiato, just to chill for like the half an hour before we leave. Our bodies are dead. Like, so how are you feeling? I feel throbbing. <laughs> So we're just going to sit and enjoy this until we need to get our luggage and wait for the shuttle. I'm hoping the shuttle's not too busy. I don't know what stop we are, so I'm just hoping that it's chill and we can get on. And then we've just got to navigate the airport, get on the flight, and then drive home. It's a long day. Um, so we're on the shuttle. Um, in case you're wondering, it is the mask on the transport. Um, different drivers have like different policies whether they use them or not but as a general rule like Disney says wear the mask if you're on the transport so that's on the magic shuttle to and from the airport and the park shuttle to and from the parks so we're going to just take our I'm lucky that we've got on here because it's actually quite busy so we're going to say get to the shuttle like 20-25 minutes before you're due to depart just so you can make sure that you get on the shuttle and get to the airport on time Try and show a sad face when you're wearing a mask. <laughs> There's a proper go for it. <laughs> How dare I leave? <laughs> Luton, we just sat waiting for my parents to come pick us up. It's cold. It is it is a bit chilly. It's dark. It's not as exciting as Soph said. It's not like sitting on Main Street. <laughs> yeah, there's no parade coming in 10 minutes. It's just my parents to pick us up. But bless them, it's literally like half ten, so they're gonna get back at gone midnight. So half ten? Well, like quarter past. Oh, 20, ten past. But yeah, so we're just going to chill here and wait for my parents to come pick Fall us up. Thank you for following along. It must have been like a very higgledy piggledy day because <laughs> we literally had no plan really. We just other than with the flow. Yeah, other than watch the parade and get to studio so that Safe could see the Lightning McQueen like cavalcade. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much. And I think I'm going to go because I'm so tired. My arm is hurting just holding up the camera. Like London, no? 